everyone, welcome to the Alaska Zoo. Today we are in front of George, our black bill magpie habitat behind me. And George came to the Alaska Zoo in 2007. George actually flew into our elephant house, landed on our keeper's shoulder, and started talking. After George flew into the old elephant house at the Alaska Zoo and decided to start talking to the keepers, the zoo handed the young magpie over to Bird Treatment Learning Center to see if George could be integrated with other magpies for release. George, however, was deemed imprinted and therefore unable to survive on her own out in the wild and was handed back over to the Alaska Zoo as a permanent resident for our facility. Magpies can live up to 15 years under human-managed care at facilities just like the Alaska Zoo. As you can see, George is an active participant in her health care, participating daily with keepers and trainers, doing things like flying from perch to perch, stationing, and of course, getting on a scale so that we can get daily weights. Magpies are omnivores, eating lots of different types of food resources, eating both plant matter and meat. They can eat insects, grain, carrion, and even some small rodents. They're commonly seen foraging on the ground for food, as well as on the backs of large mammal species trying to feed on insects or ticks. In this video, you see curator Shannon Jensen working with George today on George's training, making sure that their relationship is strong to continue this into the future. Magpies, along with other corvids, will hide or cache food supplies. You can see George is doing this right here. George is even using sticks and leaves to cover up those caches so nobody else can find them. Sometimes corvids will raid other caches, creating social dynamics. Black-billed magpies and other corvids are known to be mimic animals, meaning they can actually hear different sounds from their natural habitat and repeat it to be their own sound. You can commonly see George on Facebook at George the Talking Magpie. Right there on that page, you can actually find videos of George talking frequently and special updates of George with photographs and different training sessions as well. George is pretty famous and George makes the Alaska Zoo pretty famous too.